Oh, hey yo, what is going on you guys? Welcome back, and and just so you know, if you do encounter life outside of this planet, it's probably best not to treat it like a pet, I'm just saying. Life, all right guys, so pretty much about a space that, pretty much about a space station that is trying to intercept it's trying to intercept this shuttle that is coming towards them, unfortunately um, coming at them very, very very fast and really, you know, unorthodox. It's kind of like tumbling its way through the frick, through freaking space and they're trying to capture it, study it, and also study the Martian life form that is within it. Now, while it is an incredible discovery, like I said in the beginning of this video, it's probably not the best thing to pet it and try to like, you know, keep it like a pet. You know, it's got a mind of its own, it's probably gonna kill you. So, <laughs> So this thing goes on a killing spree, and definitely the, the and definitely the end goal is trying to capture it and probably kill it in the process. So now, why that is pretty much the very basic plot of the movie that I just summed up for you guys. There's a lot more to it, so let's go ahead and let's keep talking about it. So let's go ahead and let's talk about the characters, guys. All right, so. Huh. Ryan Reynolds, I love Ryan Reynolds to death, and I definitely enjoyed him in this film. He is by far a very funny guy without trying too hard to be funny. I do enjoy his performance in the movie. He is definitely not the star of it. So let's go ahead to Jake Gyllenhaal, and Jake Gyllenhaal, guys, he is pretty damn good. He is definitely, it's definitely really good. So. It's definitely very good for what he's trying to go for, and that's exactly what I think worked very well for him. He's a scientist, he's a smart guy, he, he's very perplexed on how hard it is trying to kill this damn thing. Hell, I freaking thought he was dead like about a million times, and shit, this thing is definitely one tough son of a bitch. I'm just gonna say that, I'm just gonna throw it out there. Also, so while I'm not gonna spoil the whole movie for you guys, because that's not what I'm trying to do, I'm not trying to do that to you guys. In fact, I really enjoy this movie, so definitely I want you guys to go check it out. So let's con so let's go ahead and let's move on. The cinematography, huh, guys? The way this movie opens up, it's freaking awesome. It is a very long single shot. Now I'm gonna now I'm a little bit now I'm a little bit you know worry about that because while I don't believe there was any cuts, there may have been one, but I don't believe there was one. So I'm gonna say it's a one-shot take. And trust me, it is long and there would have to be so many things for this thing to go right. Again, it may not have been, but I'm gonna believe that it is. And it opens up the movie and it is perfect. Everything is so perfect, it is just a bewonderment and bewildering on how they achieved it. But I loved it. There's a there's also a, a ton of amazing shots in this movie, and I especially enjoy all of them. And of course, let's talk about the special effects CGI. This freaking thing, while it is a little bit on the more translucent, weird-looking, alien-looking side of it, it does come across as a little bit original, but also not too original because it's an alien. So there's only so many designs you can come up with, but. This thing, it's freaking weird and scary and it's terrifying and it is definitely one tough son of a bitch to kill. So let's also talk about one thing I don't always talk about, but the soundtrack, the atmosphere. Guys, this freaking movie reminds me of the origin of the of Alien. It's so the atmosphere is so intense and it's so antsy and it's just like it's just so freaking intense. It tenses you up and it makes you just like what the hell is going to happen next? What is it going to take for them to kill this thing? What is it going to take for them to try to make it out of this alive? And it's death and it and it works out so well. Mo there was so many times where I was on the edge of my seat just going like what the what are they gonna do? Why is this thing? Why is this thing still freaking alive? Oh my god! Headaches almost. Just trying to figure out what the hell this thing is. What's it trying to do? And of course, you're trying to. And then of course, there's so many other things going on. And of course, while this, of course, it's a horror movie, and of course, people die, and you grow attached to these characters. One one thing I'm gonna touch on that I don't normally touch on, and it's. Bewildering again because normally, all right, some movies always try to slow things down, trying to establish everything. Guys, I want to believe this movie is far longer than it was, but this movie goes through goes through what like almost two hours 
or more than two hours, it goes through though, it goes through that like if it's freaking nothing. I swear, like when this movie was like almost close to ending, I was like, holy shit, this movie's going pretty fast, isn't it? I've never seen a, I've never, I've never seen a movie go through itself so fast like this movie does. Like I swear. The movie was like it was. Long. It's a pretty. I, I'm more than sure it's a long movie. I'm more than sure it's close to the two-hour mark, if not beyond it. But I am so just like blown away by how quick it was. Normally in Alien, you feel that yes, it is a long, slow burn, and sometimes some people don't like it. Some people do. This movie, it's like whoosh, let's go get let's get to the ending as fast as we possibly can. Let's take the shortest route to get there. And I shit you not. It took the shortest route to get there, and damn, did it go through everything so fast. While I, while I did somewhat enjoy it because it definitely was a, it's different, and it's it, it's it's different because it's so intense and it's so high and it, it keeps you it keeps you on your toes. I enjoyed every moment of it. I enjoyed every moment of this movie while it was very fast. Everything else just seems to work. All the characters to me were really really good. And now there is a couple things where I didn't really like. Because I feel like I could have outsmarted this alien at every turn, but there's always something in the way of trying to achieve that. It's just as as if anything can possibly go wrong, it goes wrong in this movie. <laughs> so wrapping this whole movie up, guys. While there is some little things, little things, just really really small. It's really nitpicky, so I'm not gonna really bring them up. Um, this thing, this movie has so many things going for it. I think that it is a fantastic movie. It is definitely, and you know, it's really weird because you know, some a lot of movies tend to go with the grain, try to either make it slow or try to make it really fast. This movie, it's meant to be slow, but it goes through it really fast, so it's going against the grain. It's kind of weird, but you know, you really enjoy it because it's going because it's weird, and then you know, it's just blah 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 blah. Overall, guys. This movie has really good characters. I enjoyed everyone's performance in this movie. Um, the plot is really good. I did enjoy it. While there was some certain things where I was like, you know what, it, a lot of problems could have been solved if this happened. But definitely that does not happen in this movie. Um, the cinematography, like I said, it's really, really good. The CGI is really good. Um, there is a little bit of the blood did not look too good, but yeah, that's that's kind of either here nor there. I mean, it's in space. Who knows how the hell blood acts up like? And of course, it pisses you off because you can't kill it. But damn it, I freaking enjoyed it. So if I have to rate this movie, guys, I'm gonna have to give it a nine out of ten. It's not a perfect ten, but it is a really damn good movie, and I highly recommend you guys go ahead and check it out. And that is the end of this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, by all means, hit that like button as well as subscribe to my YouTube channel. We make more videos just like this, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.